Way up in Texas, just like a dream, there happened a story you must see to believe. Down by the river, with sky so blue, lay a small town of Whoville, the home of the Who's. Hi, I'm Lexi Luhu. Hi, I'm Connor Kuhu. Hi, I'm Friendly Boo. <laughs> Ask any who, and they'll have to say, there's no dog like Christmas, and it's her gotcha day. Every dog was special, but this one is dressed, and the who's just loved her a little bit more than the rest. special. What about all the other dogs over here? This is Christmas. Yeah. She's special. She's, She's the most special of all special. Millie was fine. Fiona was pleasant. Ritzy always stayed. Even Sadie was present. But everyone knew from her toes to her snout, they loved Christmas the most, without a single doubt. Oh yes, everyone down in Whoville loved Christmas a lot. But there was one who lived just south, the Grinch, who absolutely did not. I don't know why I would ever leave this place. Everything about it is just absolutely perfect, just you and me, eh? <laughs> hello, 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 home sweet home. The Grinch hated Christmas, her whole gotcha season. Now please don't ask why, because there really is no reason. Now it could be that his head wasn't screwed on this right. Or perhaps his shoes may have been a little too tight. But I think the most likely reason of all may have been his heart was two what sizes too small. What is that noise? Oh, I cannot stand that Christmas. Oh, I'm sorry. I hope, I hope you uh, I don't know what to do, sweetie. I don't know. So whatever the reason, be it his heart or his shoes, he stood outside his cabin, hating the Who's. Yes, the Grinch knew tomorrow all the Who's girls and boys would wake bright and early to give their dogs toys. Then the Who, young and old, would let their dogs feast. You see, gotcha day. It called for roast beast. And the more the Grinch thought of what Christmas Day would bring, the more the Grinch thought, I must stop this whole thing. A whole year! I've put up with it. But I must stop Gotcha Day from happening. But how? And then he got an idea. And awful idea. I know just what to do. The Grinch laughed in his throat as he checked his Santa's hat and coat. He chuckled and clucked at his great Grinchy trick. With this fancy outfit, I'll look just like Saint Nick. You're a mean one, Mr. Grinch. The old Grinchy claws as he climbed through the window. He knew the hoof was sleeping, and no one would ever know. His sneaky plan was to steal little Christmas, so there'd be no celebrating or remembering who she was. 
Christmas was rescued a whole year ago. The Grinch hated that story. The girl you've all gotten to know. And the Grinch grabbed the dog and as he started to leave, he heard a small sound. Mr. Grinch, what are you doing with Christmas? From somewhere next to the tree. The Grinch did not answer, just walked out the door. No gotcha day celebration and no Christmas to adore. Down to his cabin with Christmas in tow. The Who's would be awake soon. Oh, they'll certainly know. The Who's woke Are up, and they knew Christmas. she was missing. It was Christmas. Lexi Lou Who and Connor Coo Who, who went to go get Chrissy. Yeah, The Grinch told them no! In fact, he told them where to go. But Christmas the dog. But those isn't who's all don't give up. Just a little In part fact, of it. They're quite tough. Well, that didn't go very well at all. Yeah. Wait, hold on. How will we go back again if we don't have And what happened then? Well, in Whoville, they say, the Grinch's small heart grew three sizes that day. the dog on her special Christmas day. Come in, Mr. Grinch. Uh, hey, I'm Mr. Grinch. I'm Mr. Grinch. I'm coming. I was thinking about what you said, and I, I, I want to apologize. Come in, Mr. Grinch. 
Come on, let's go. Are you sending an apology? Here, come on. Let's go sit down. I have brought you Christmas. He joined all the Who's. He even learned how to play. Merry Christmas, y'all. You have to say it. I have to say it. Merry Christmas. <laughs>